stage of the Hell Pop Tour with All Hail the Yeti. And we got Connor. Hey. We got Steve. We got Craw. And we got Nick. Hello. And I have to ask, since All Hail the Yeti now, who is the folklore person in the band? Who loves folklore the, the most here? Well, I think we all do. I think you we all do? do. But, uh, I mean, that's definitely been something that's been with me since I was a child, for sure. But I think we're all definitely, like, in a different aspect. I think we all have it, for sure. Abominable Snowman or regular Yeti? Uh, Sasquatch. Bigfoot, Sasquatch, yeah. Bigfoot. Okay. Are you asking like who would win in a fight or? Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> depends you know? where, it depends where they're from. Like if yeah. they're like a Pacific or West Sasquatch. That's a location. Or like thing. the southern states. Like how, how, how many classifications of Sasquatches yeah, are there? Oh, there's, there's a lot. Yeah. Don't don't get me a, don't make <laughs> me get me <laughs> started. Oh, every uh, uh, every Steve, region how long do we have? has their own legend. What's the most interesting legend of the Sasquatch? The skunk Cape well, is pretty bizarre. I mean, yeah, the skunk cave's great. Well, there's a story of a place called Deep Creek, Idaho. Mm -hmm. And that's pretty legendary. Tell us more. No. Keep wire in mind. Doesn't want to just take too long. <laughs> it's a pretty long story, but basically a family member of mine was picked up by one, grabbed, you know. So that's where the song Deep Creek came from. All right, and uh, now you guys have been secretly writing a little bit more music? Is it going to be involve a lot more folklore as well? It'll, it'll, it's going to have everything, I think. It's going to have a little bit of, uh, of folklore, a little bit of campfire stories, mm -hmm. a little bit more personal stuff. And, uh, everything is always some sort of a story. So. We got more harmonica. I love the, the metal harmonica. No, we're going we're gonna to turn it up. We're going to get some didgeridoo. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Get some uh, thousand didgeridoo. Flutes. <laughs> flutes. Flutes on the list. Yep. What other instruments do you want to put in there that you haven't experimented with? Slide guitar. B3. Yeah. Oh, well, we'll yeah. probably yes. go with the slide guitar. Yeah. I, would, I would love to have some kind of keys in there, like soul, B3 yeah. organs. Soul, soul, soul. Organs, yeah. for yeah. sure. Yeah. Creepy no, organs no, would yes. be great. Yes. Yes. No, no organs. I'm already, I'm oh, already done it. I go to organs. Organs? Maybe a small yeah. organ. Like, like intestines, small organs. No, that goes with the stage setup. And I do love your stage setup with all the... The Thank you. Crocodile heads and just the feel. It's kind of got a really deep south, a little bit of a, a like a voodoo type of vibe to it. It's kind of it's, we kind of have our own like each of us have our own world, I guess. Mm -hmm. you know, Nick has totem. his kind of yeah total basically. Nick has his his bison skull with the rib cage, and Craw has his you know alligator alligator head and with the head like dress. wolf head and voodoo kind of voodoo satanic priest whatever. You know. Definitely yeah, it's cool. Now, how does that relay on tour? Some some people actually come up and they say, "Oh, that's cool," or do some people get freaked out by it? Both. Yeah. Both. Yeah. yeah. Then that's good. <laughs> <laughs> the kid, like the kids normally just kind of checking it out, holding yeah. each other going. But the adults are like, "Okay, it's a show. It's something yeah, different. I've never seen that before. Yeah, we get we get it all the time. Thanks for that. It looks awesome. Thanks for putting you know, putting on the show." So I think, I think any type of reaction is a good is a good thing, you know, whether it's negative or positive, it's still a reaction. It is something they're gonna go home thinking, man, exactly. man this, this one man is crazy out all these dead animals on stage. Or their parents or their parents like you can't listen <laughs> you to that. You can't listen to that and buy all the merch. They're safe. Which is good. That's good. <laughs> yeah. Which is what you want, you know, because when your parents start telling you you can't listen to it, it's like fucking hey, I'm gonna listen to it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. From mm -hmm. my from growing up, that was how it was for me. Because you were a naughty boy. I was bad. Well, what was the one band you couldn't listen to? Your parents wouldn't allow you to listen to. They were actually really good about it, but they like would take the album covers away. Oh yeah. Yeah. So you know, a lot of the glam, like <laughs> I understand the first Cannibal Corpse, corpse. <laughs> but yeah, you know, even going into Cannibal Corpse, Dia side, like that stuff. But like as a younger kid, mm -hmm. you know, the whole thing with the videos of like you know the glam metal bands and girls naked and all yeah. that shit. My mom was just like. No fucking way are you watching that. <laughs> you can listen to the music all day long, but you can't fucking watch the videos. So you can't have the posters or any of that shit. But give them to your dad. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what man could you not listen to? Blink-182. Uh, Bad Religion. <laughs> Bad Religion was And Guttermouth. Gutter, oh, okay, I was gutter a mouth. huge into like, the, the old school the old pop school punk. punk is great. And, and Guttermouth and Bad Religion. Just the name Bad Religion my mom hated. <laughs> I'm gonna look at the lyrics of these songs. Oh, like, no, I need no, to make I sure. Bet, I bet you no and fuck that. Yeah, it's like, bro, what do you got? What couldn't you listen to? Dude, I, I come from a crazy upbringing, so anything was anything was all right. Absolutely, dude. Yeah, 
But I, I listened to more blues and country as a kid, you know, Skinner and shit like that. Mm -hmm. But like more metal, more metal stuff, it didn't matter. Yeah. yeah. Actually, you should watch old Pantera, the VHS Pantera videos <laughs> <laughs> with my mother. Oh, She's really? Absolutely They're on crazy. DVD now, yeah. just so you know. Right. Oh, they make, <laughs> they make the big <laughs> DVD? <laughs> yeah, I, blue but yeah, dude, I still have it at my mother's house down in Louisiana. I still have those VHS. I guarantee that. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I can yeah. see them there. I, don't um, know what I was pretty much the same way, man. I was pretty much open to <laughs> anything else. Open to anything, yeah. I was lucky that I got to listen to that stuff. But I remember, you know, his father probably like, took the pictures of most of the <laughs> band anyway. and I remember, like, you know. Borrowing my older sister's records and stuff, and like David like, Gibson, Busted, Alice in Chains, and you know Chili Peppers and stuff like Blood Sugar, Sex Magic. I remember listening to that, and you know hearing Anthony Kiedis say "motherfucker" and "fuck" and shit, yeah, and talking about his dick like and balls talking about jokes and everything. Like, I was like, gay sex, fuck and shit like that. Actually <laughs> saying that stuff, man, this is wild, you know. So, but yeah, I mean, it was I wasn't really you know, very. Uh, there wasn't really too much that was compliments musically for me, so I'm lucky in that, in that regard. <laughs> you guys seem pretty close. You've been touring a lot together in one yeah. small band. If you had to choose one guy to kick kick out of the van and actually live in the trailer, who would it be? <laughs> who would live in, Who's living in the trailer? Uh, Who's living in the trailer? Well, honestly, none of us, dude. Honestly, really? We, 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 we actually get along really well. The only time I would say that anyone needs to go in the trailer is when one of these two dudes Who's got the worst smelling uh, feet? Worst smelling feet? It's, it's probably me, but well, not, we not in a while. You're only yeah, first either is Nick. Yeah, I've, I've, I've yeah. been in the car with Nick, and his feet literally have made me grow up. <laughs> <laughs> but I've also been with Steve and have the same thing. So yeah, honestly, I, you know, I really yeah. never, you know. I mean, if I if I had to vote, I would probably say Connor. Yeah, if you had to vote. Oh, he's the farter, Connor? Connor's the farter. Yeah, but you like, made him throw up once from a fart too. Did, actually. I did. I oh, did. that's worse. But that's I mean, worse. He's, he's got a sensitive gag reflex, so there's not really, you know. It's you stink. What? Not a whole lot I can do. <laughs> 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 oh. uh, Hold on. How do you know uh, this? <laughs> Trust me. Don't worry. I'm not going to ask any more know. questions about that. I'm going to leave that being his name. Awkward. I'm concerned. Who wants to switch seats? But that's, yes. the one. that's a story for another time. Uh, speaking of stories, what's the the craziest road story you guys have? Far Craw, Nick, you want to tell that one about San Jose? San Jose oh, it is. Oh, oh. all right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this, this <laughs> work on cross yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's the that's the one that I can think of. Like, yeah, right it's, off it's the not bat. the it's not horrible man. And but, positive. Well, we yeah, we were in San Jose and we just finished a show, um, <laughs> and uh, we went out. We had we played with some friends of ours. Uh, they're a band called Death Valley High. They're a local band from up there. And uh, so we went out with uh, the singer and the drummer afterwards, and they knew this great little burrito spot. So we went and fucking fucked up. It was good. Yeah, we did some <laughs> good little. It was just like this little shack, you know. And it had uh, just to paint a picture. It, it was Stairs. sort of like the the foundation was elevated off of street level, and it had these cement steps that went up to it, you know. And so we're and everybody's out. hammering. Now, Everyone's yeah. We're we've all been drinking. We're no, no, just, I'm talking about all the people. Though. Yeah, and I mean, and this is like you know two o'clock in the morning. This place is open all night, so there's all sorts of creatures and stuff stumbling in there. And, and so you know, Fra and I are outside. We we finish eating. And we're, we're just kind of hanging out, like just shit. shooting the shit, yeah. whatever. And then all of a sudden, the door <laughs> flies open. Flies open. And this this oh, young man. girl, she couldn't have been more than like sixteen or seventeen she's years old. Got her old. hands over like she this. comes running out of the place, but then she's got her hand over her mouth like this, and, and she's throwing up. The like, Nickelodeon slide. Yeah, she's throwing up through her hand, <laughs> and it's kind of out of her fingers. So she comes, she hits the door, comes through there, Puke slips in her own puke, and then, oh. and then it goes <laughs> bup, 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 down those cement steps. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But then Nick, so right, so naturally, that's, that's our natural reaction. Nick said, "All right, all right, all right." I can't <laughs> So yeah, so I was feeling, you know, especially loopy at that point. So yeah, so I, I yeah, chimed in. Alive. All right, all right, all right, like that. Nice and loud. Like he yeah. starts laughing his ass off, and the girls didn't like that. Then before we know it, their two friends who have kind of been standing over here on the side this whole time just immediately rush up to us, and they just, you know, they're not happy with just our reaction. Just fucking ghetto ass, fucking San Jose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, these chicks are just so angry, man, and they're getting in both of our 
faces and yelling and stuff. And I mean, I'm, I'm much more even tempered than, than this guy here. So I was kind of just laughing it off. But he, he started getting a little bit heated back at him. They <laughs> called me a name. Yeah. Know? And that so, Louisiana, if someone had called you that, that's not good. And um, so, it, you know. You don't call so, anybody that. You don't call anybody, anybody that. that. But, but anyway. there's a down home. It's a word you don't call people. Yeah. It escalated. And she did. It she escalated. Did Rhymes with quickly. trigger. It escalated she, very she did, quickly. She did call me. <laughs> And, and just before I know it, like, the, 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 all the aggression has shifted over from me onto him with these two girls now that are just, like, like coming after him, like, hardcore, you know, and they're just, like, it goes cute, man. And, you know, and, and they're, they're, they're these little girls, like, we're not, not going to fight these girls, you know, so I'm, like, I'm kind of trying to end the middle of it. They think they'll just, hey, it's okay, yeah. and all of a sudden, I don't know where that little girl's then, face yeah. went, boop, right <laughs> shots on the chin from this Clip. little girl. Chin music. Little two piece. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she rubbed, she rubbed my bell with one a little bit there, right on, uh, right on the chin. and um, It was hilarious. People were outside watching. Uh, yeah, it, it turned into this whole big scene, so we kind of had to get out of there. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. They started sprouting that gang gang shit. They did. Like, oh, no. Well, the girls were proud of where they were from. And that was, that North was side and all this. Yeah, and nice. like, let's go. Nick just got beat up. We got to get him out of here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they did. I was you know, groggy. They had to drag me out of there. No, no. It was funny. We, we, we laughed about it. That was probably one of the wildest stories. It yeah, sounds like yeah. it, was, it was fun, man. I felt it the next morning, though, for sure. That, that little girl definitely connected. Gave <laughs> <laughs> a little two people. Yeah, she's she's going to lose two. She's going to me up. She was so cute. Right she's like, bless, bless her heart. So <laughs> yeah, but like, it's like three of my fingers. Yeah, like, oh, dude, <laughs> and how much, much, much hell do you give them about that every single day? No, no. No, it's when it comes up. It's like, you got beat up by a little girl. You got, you got beat up. And you know, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that, honestly. Like, it was a good one. Honestly, thanks for having my back. He handled it very well. Yeah, I, was, I got out of like, the boy's back, man. Yeah. You know? I probably would have spit on her or like, what are you doing? Like, this is ridiculous. He just was like, we yeah. turned, we turned yeah. into yeah. a joke. It was funny. It was from that. You weren't joking. You were, you were pissed off. He was laughing. Yeah. You were like, I'm gonna fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And at that point, they started sprout, like, spouting gang yeah. fucking like north side and. You guys better get out of here. And so it's like, okay, I'm gonna go. I was inside the Indian Burrito. Seems <laughs> like the whole thing. The screw it, I was yeah, you whatever. showed up late for that one, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that was weird. Why? <laughs> what, what happened? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it must have been a damn good burrito. That's all I gotta say. So, yeah, it was. Mm -hmm. You guys have been on tour a lot lately. What's the one thing you missed about home? Name one thing. My dog. Yeah. My animals, my chick, all that. My wife. Yeah, me too. Yeah, my Shit. girlfriend. <laughs> My wife. <laughs> Damn it. Someone's in trouble. We may just have just left. Yeah. We, we just left. That was yesterday. We've been gone for like not even 24 hours. Okay, my wife. My wife and my dog. Mm -hmm. Cox. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's okay. You're going to you sleep next time with the dog now. Yeah, well, yeah. My Nintendo. You guys can edit that out. Okay, we'll edit that out. Please. No, thank you very much for uh, spending some time with us backstage at the Hell Pop Tour. Always a And I cannot wait game. for the new album. Uh, any possible release? or No. No, no just kind of... Are you we're real? We're in the, the very beginning. The very beginning, beginning stages okay. of pre-production and writing, and we're, we're going to make sure it's flawless before we uh, Take your time. Don't rush. So, uh, thank you very much, guys. Have a good rest of the tour. Anything? Is everybody good here? We have enough booze? Oh, no, we're good. Oh, more, more, more whiskey. You need more whiskey? Jack Daniels. You need a bottle of Jack? I'll be right back.